What's up YouTube? How you doing? This is a brand new 2011 or 2012 Dodge Caravan. This is Joe and Colin from the Delray Customs YouTube channel. Just wanted to give you a quick overview on how to remove a brand new stereo from this car. So we're just going to go over that and walk you through it. You only need two major parts, a third if you want to protect the dash. All you need is a plastic fat flat panel popper, a drill or a Phillips screwdriver, usually a Phillips to, you know, safer than sorry, and some blue tape just to wrap around the dash. So basically if you notice, there's only one trim piece around the radio. That's actually all you need to pull out. Be careful though, uh, there are two snaps directly to the left and right of the knob. So give it a little pry on the top and then slowly work your way around but make sure you release those snaps. The minute you get those two snaps released, bad angle. Yeah. There we go. And we're doing this in real time just to show you guys how easy this is. The snaps come out and you kind of have to lift and point upward to get the whole thing out because it's it's got these little hook plastic tabs in the back so put that aside and make sure you don't scratch it then there's going to be four Phillips two on each side right there so I'm going to go ahead and take those out real quick make sure you don't lose them even though it might be a little difficult to get to sometimes losing them is the worst thing you could do chances are you're not going to have something else that'll fit that spot in your install bay or at home since this video is for those do-it-yourselfers on YouTube nah, I'll get that later Once you got the four screws pulled out, you just jimmy it a little, jiggle it out just to get it released. Some screws might come out with you, and that's it. Behind the radio, you're going to have one or two harnesses. One harness is going to be your audio and power and CAN bus line. The other is your European antenna plug and or adapter. If you're using the right stuff, you'll have a Metra dash kit, a pack audio amplifier integration piece and a Metra steering wheel adapter if your car came with it. We'll and put that all those is links in the bottom. That's all you need to pull this out. A plastic panel popper and a Phillips screwdriver, some tape to protect your dash. Once again, Joe and Colin at the Delray Customs YouTube channel. Thanks guys.